What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about something that could literally change everything. Elon Musk's Grok 5 and his explosive claim that it might actually achieve AGI. Yeah, you heard that right. Artificial general intelligence by the end of this year. I know it sounds crazy, but let's break down what's actually happening behind the scenes. So it all started on September 17th when Elon dropped this absolute bombshell on Twitter. He said, I now think XAI has a chance of reaching AGI with Grok 5. Never thought that before. Now, coming from the guy who literally warned us that AI was more dangerous than nuclear weapons just a few years ago, this is a complete 180. Mark my words, AI is far more dangerous than nukes. Far. So why do we have no regulatory oversight? This is insane. The same person who signed an open letter calling for an AI pause is now racing toward the very thing he was warning us about. But here's the kicker. This isn't just some random tech CEO making bold predictions. Elon's got a track record. Tesla, SpaceX, PayPal. When this guy sets his mind to something revolutionary, he tends to deliver. And the technical foundation backing up these claims? It's actually pretty solid. Before we talk about Grok 5, let's look at what Grok 4 has already achieved, because it's honestly mind-blowing. On the ARC AGI benchmark, which is specifically designed to test how AI reasons like humans, Grok 4 is absolutely dominating. The ARC AGI test is brutal. It's designed to resist static knowledge and test genuine problem-solving abilities. While other AI models have been struggling with these tests for years, Grok 4 just waltzed in and posted the best scores we've ever seen. But it's not just one benchmark. Grok 4 is crushing it across the board. Number one on Live Code Bench, 95% on AMIE 2025 Mathematics, 87.5% on GPQA scientific reasoning, and 75% on SWE bench for coding tasks. And here's what's really crazy. Independent developers are choosing Grok 4 over everything else. There are developers using Grok 4 exclusively for game development, even though they're not traditional coders. They're using something called Vibe Coding, basically intuitive AI-assisted programming, and getting incredible results. Now let's talk about the beast powering all of this, Colossus 2. This isn't just any supercomputer, this is the world's first gigawatt plus AI training system. To put this in perspective, XAI built Colossus with 100,000 NVIDIA H100 GPUs in just 122 days. Most data centers take four years just to finalize plans, and XAI built the whole thing in four months. But they're not stopping there. The plan is to scale up to 200,000 GPUs with potential expansion to over 550,000 NVIDIA B200, B300 GPUs. Elon is literally shipping entire power plants from overseas to power this thing. The world's richest man confirms he's shipping an entire power plant across the globe here to Memphis. And here's what makes XAI different from the competition. While companies like OpenAI and Google have to split their compute between serving millions of users and research, XAI can dedicate almost everything to pure research and development. That's a massive advantage. So, what exactly is Grok 5 going to bring to the table? Based on everything we know, it's going to address every weakness that Grok 4 currently has. First up, multimodal capabilities. Right now, Grok 4 is essentially blind when it comes to visual and video processing. Grok 5 is going to have full vision capabilities and even video generation. When you think about AGI, a system that can't see or process visual information is obviously limited. Second, they're implementing what they call deep thinking and extended reasoning chains, this means Grok 5 will be able to work through complex problems step by step, similar to how humans approach difficult challenges. Third, tool integration. Grok 5 will have access to enterprise tools and incredibly accurate physics simulators. 
Imagine an AI that can actually run complex simulations and use professional software. And here's the big one. Elon claims that Grok 5 will be capable of discovering new physics and technologies. I, I think it may discover new technologies uh, as soon as later this year. Um, and I, I would be shocked if it is not done so next year. So I would expect Grok to yeah, literally discover new, new technologies that are actually useful no later than next year and maybe end of this year. He's literally saying this AI could make Nobel Prize worthy discoveries. Now let's address the elephant in the room. Is this actually possible or is it just typical Elon hype? The skeptics make some valid points. True AGI would need more than just high benchmark scores. We're talking about creativity, emotional intelligence, common sense reasoning, and the ability to learn and adapt in ways current AI simply can't. The ARC benchmark that Grok4 dominates, its creator has already released ARC2, and he doesn't expect even that to be solved next year. Solving harder benchmarks doesn't automatically equal AGI. But here's what the supporters point to. The infrastructure is real, the progress is measurable, and the timeline might actually be achievable. When former Google DeepMind researcher Dustin Tran left after eight years to join XAI, his reasoning was telling. He said XAI has more compute per researcher than he ever experienced at Google. This isn't happening in a vacuum. The entire AI industry is in an arms race right now, and Grok 5's potential AGI claims are forcing everyone else to accelerate their timelines. OpenAI just released GPT-5, which is incredibly impressive in its own right. But when you look at head-to-head -head comparisons, Grok 4 is already outperforming GPT-5 in several key areas, especially in coding and safety. Google's got their advanced Gemini models, Anthropic has Claude, but none of them are making the bold AGI claims that Musk is making. The question is whether XAI's approach of pure computational power and aggressive scaling will actually work. So, when can we actually expect to see Grok 5? Elon says before the end of this year, but let's be honest, this is Elon time we're talking about. However, the training has reportedly already started as of September 2025. The release will likely follow XAI's usual pattern, first available through X Premium subscriptions, then API access for developers, and eventually broader integration across Musk's companies. Tesla integration could be particularly interesting, potentially making Grok 5 one of the first AGI-capable systems that regular consumers interact with daily. But we can't ignore the safety implications here. If Grok 5 actually approaches AGI-level capabilities, we're entering completely uncharted territory. Musk himself has warned about AI risks, but there's a big difference between understanding the problems and actually solving them. The alignment and control problems become much more pressing with more capable systems. And unlike some other AI companies that prioritize safety research, XAI seems to be prioritizing raw capability development. So, what does all this mean for regular people? If Grok 5 delivers even half of what Musk is promising, we're looking at AI capabilities that could transform every industry. We're talking about AI that could make genuine scientific discoveries, solve complex engineering problems autonomously, potentially accelerate research and development across all fields, change how we work, learn, and create but it also raises questions about job displacement, economic disruption, and whether we're ready for such rapid change. Look, I'll be straight with you. Elon Musk has a history of ambitious timelines that don't always pan out. Remember full self-driving next year for the past several years? But here's what's different this time. The progress is publicly verifiable. We can see Grok 4's benchmark scores. We can verify the Colossus supercomputer exists. Independent researchers are replicating and exceeding XAI's results. Whether Grok 5 achieves true AGI by the end of 2025 remains to be seen. But what's undeniable is that XAI is pushing the boundaries of what's possible in AI, and the entire industry is responding. The next few months are going to be absolutely crucial. We're either about to witness the birth of artificial general intelligence, 
or we're going to get another lesson in the difference between hype and reality. What do you think? Are we actually on the verge of AGI, or is this just more tech billionaire overpromising? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. If you found this breakdown helpful, smash that like button and subscribe for more AI deep dives, and hit the notification bell because trust me, you don't want to miss what happens next in this story. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.